Now, one of the questions I always try to seek the answer, why Sony fail in cell phone departments? Matter of fact, if we look to Sony as a whole company, their market cap is $108 billion. Their share current time, $85. That means Sony is a big company. Now, if you go check PlayStation department, most successful in video game and entertainment. Besides of this, they have the TVs, a Sony camera with Alpha department, one of the best camera on the world. But why Sony phones not appealing to people and why Sony doesn't sell a lot of phones? This is what I'm gonna answer in this video. I'm gonna tell you the secret why Sony in purpose not trying to be successful in a cell phone department. This is Variety Stick. Make sure to watch this video till the end and subscribe if you haven't. Give me a thumbs up and activate the bell to receive notification every time we upload videos in this channel. Without any further ado, let's find out. Now, before I tell you my actual reason why Sony is not successful in cell phone department, I've checked this website and they have nine reasons why Sony Mobile failed. Let's go ahead and check those together and see if the reason makes sense or not. Now, the first reason they're saying a high price tag, which is I believe Sony, if they want to be more competitive, they will bring a more affordable devices. So in my opinion, this is not a good reason. And also you can leave your comment if you agree with every reason they have on that website or not. Leave this in a comment below. But I don't think so because the price is high. Yes, maybe some of the phones currently available through Sony, they're expensive. That because Sony doesn't sell a lot of phones and that makes sense the price to be a little bit higher. Now reason number two, it couldn't compete with Apple user. Now I agree Apple, they have their own share, they have their own ecosystem. But if we take Samsung as a company make phones with Android, Samsung is very competitive and they have more share and more subscribers than Apple. So if Sony would put all the effort to make more competitive a product, I would say they will take share and they become more competitive. That Sony doesn't even provide phones right now. Now, reason number three, weak relationship with the US service providers. In other words, Sony is not successful to make good relationship to sell their phones with AT&T, T-Mobile, and Verizon. What well, I would say this is not true because Sony PlayStation, the main office here in the USA, and they have very good relationship with so many studios, etc. And they sell a lot of camera for American, etc. So I don't think so. This is a valid reason. Reason number four, poor availability. Of course, when Sony doesn't make more than five phones a year, it's not gonna be available for people to buy Plus, we have mentioned that price tag is a little bit higher, so they're not going to be able to compete. In my opinion, if Sony wants to compete with other company, they will provide more phones to the market. Let's check number five, lack of marketing. Lack of marketing that because they don't sell or they're not willing to sell a lot of phones. Yes, they're not going to advertise these phones because they're not pushing the sale because there is a secret reason why Sony doesn't want to push this sale. But just watch this video uh, with me. I want to tell you my opinion, what I believe, what's this secret reason why Sony doesn't want to push those phones. Number six, poor launching. I mean, if we look to Sony in general, when they launch any product, they put so much effort, and I believe they are more successful launching product if they were willing to push that product. Yes, it's poor launching that because Sony doesn't focus on the cell phone department in general. Now, number seven, they're saying is not enough funding. And I show you the market cap for Sony, $108 billion. So Sony has a lot of money. So I disagree with this. Now, confusing device names. I would say this is kind of right because Sony, they have weird names, Xperia 2, Xperia Mark 2, Mark 3, Xperia 1X, Xperia 2X. Yeah, very confusing. They should have Xperia 1, 2, 3, or A like Samsung. It will make more since I agree with this. Reason number nine, lack of innovation and design updates. But I believe Sony has a lot of innovation in other products like the camera, designs, PlayStation look futuristic. I don't think so. They don't know how to make design and the lack of innovation. Now, what the actual reason why Sony doesn't want to compete in the cell phone department? Before we tell you why, let's go ahead and check this 
website, they have a tweet from Tim Cook, which is the CEO of Apple. And he says, Tim Cook admit that iPhone use Sony camera sensor. That tells us something that every phone that Sony sells, they get money, they make profit. And this picture will show you here the CEO, Tim Cook, to Apple, trying to look to the iPhone with Sony camera, and he's visiting one of the Sony offices in this picture. Now, how many phones Apple has been sold so far? 2.4 billion phones. This is a huge amount. And you can imagine that Sony has share from every single Apple phone that they sell because Apple, they have to pay Sony to buy the sensor for the camera, which is huge. Now let's go ahead and check other factory beside Apple. Now if you look just in 2022, you will see that Samsung has sold 73 million phones. Even Samsung used Sony camera. Now Apple sold 56 million phones just last year in Xiaomi, etc. Even the cheaper phones like the Galaxy A13, the 14, the most affordable phone, Sony will make a profit. Now, why Sony want to compete the other companies if they take share from every single company in the market they make camera? And this is insane how much Sony take advantage from the cell phone department. So it makes a lot of sense that Sony doesn't want to compete other company with making phones. Not because Sony not able to make uh, cell phones. This is at least my opinion. You can leave your opinion in the comment below and you can encourage me. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe for more here on Variety Stick. Thank you so much for watching. As always, guys, we'll talk to you in the next video.